Oh, come on. <laughs> Hold up. Wait, did he take off his own collar? So I'm on TikTok and I see this old commercial with this little boy with his dad in the supermarket. And the little boy wasn't getting his way, so he started throwing a fit in the supermarket, embarrassing him and his dad. I'm talking the little boy started crawling on the floor, throwing temper tantrums, knocking down stuff, throwing things. Everybody just looking at him like, you, you ever get those stares? It's just... And the dad doesn't do anything. And at the end of the commercial, these two words pop up at the bottom of the screen. I was like, they showed this on national television? My gosh. But first of all, that was me acting crazy in the supermarket. Oh, 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 oh. My mom would have hit me with the smoothest choke slam, drop kick, last ride. She would have. <laughs> she would have. Can you imagine your mom hitting you with a last <laughs> So this idea popped in my head. What if I reacted to some banned commercials that we seen years ago as kids and we didn't think nothing of it because we were kids. But as adults, we have a bigger understanding of the world and other people and what other people do. So I searched band commercials and best band commercials of all time came up. It's about 10 minutes long. It's a straight compilation of band commercials. So if you see any commercials that unlock a memory from your childhood, put it in the comments. I feel like this is gonna be weird. There are two sides to go daddy. There's the sexy side. This quality. Yep, that's the best we got. That's the best we got. There are two sides to GoDaddy. There's the sexy side represented by Bar Raffaele and the smart side that creates a killer website for I don't your think small I've ever business seen this one. represented by Walter. Together, they're perfect. What? It's a beautiful thing. I don't think YouTube gonna like this very much. Let's go and go to the next one. Oh, I remember this. I remember this. I remember the little spider. But I what? Oh, I remember. Yeah, the spider man handles dude. Mentos rainbow. What did this have to do with Mentos? It's better to know what's coming next. Who's gonna expect getting flipped across the room by a spider? Homeboy this big. The only advantage homeboy has is he has more legs than us. What? This has nothing to do with Mentos. I forgot what the commercial was about. I thought it was going to be a bug spray commercial. Something about Raid or something. This has nothing to do with Mentos. Beter om te weten wat er komt. Daarom kan je nu zelf bepalen wat jij wilt winnen. Ga naar Mentos.nl en vertel ons wat jouw droom bereikt. Hey Dave, the day is over. Time for Bud Light. I can't. I have to cut the cheese. I thought you cut the cheese already. It wasn't me. I heard you cut the cheese this morning. I didn't see this. I like this to cut the cheese in spurts throughout the day. You should cut the cheese oh, first thing in the morning like me. Otherwise, it starts backing up. I couldn't. My girlfriend was here this morning, and you know how that goes. I cut the cheese in front of my girl once. I never heard the end of it. You ever see a woman cut the cheese? Nah, they don't do it right. They're too delicate. My grandmother cut the cheese all the time, especially as she got older. Hey, guys, I'm going to be in the back. I'm going to pinch a loaf. <laughs> Want me to pull your finger? Will you pull my finger help me cut the cheese? Oh, yeah. If I pull your finger, you'll be cutting the cheese within seconds. What? Oh, yeah. What does this have to do with beer? What does an argument about cutting cheese have to do with beer. The only thing related to a Bud Light was when he asked dude if he wanted a Bud Light in the beginning. Is there a slogan? I have to run. Gotta drop the kids off at the pool. Are those even Bud Lights? Oh, yes they are. It's just the quality is ass. Hey dog. Anti-bark collar. You want a Dorito? You got it. I've seen this before. The old Dorito logo.
Oh my gosh. Nah, 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 nah. Have y'all ever had the baked Doritos? I don't think they sell them anymore. I don't see them anywhere. Baked Doritos were hit. I love them better than the regular Doritos. I don't even see them in stores anymore. I gotta speak. Uh, speak. Yeah. Oh, come on. <laughs> Wait a minute. Hold up. Wait, did he take off his own collar? Speak. Yeah. Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> nah, a dog, a dog can't even do that. What does this have to do with Doritos? One thousand. Oh. Hi. I've been here since three in the morning throwing eggs at this new Dodge Durango. And it still looks good. Pretty impressive. No, it <laughs> Yeah, maybe I'll get some shut eye. Just let me get through the rest of these eggs. I'm appalled at the performance. What? Number one, these sandwiches for fast food restaurants never look that good. This isn't even real food. You know they really just put, put stuff together using glue, fake cheese, all of that. He probably bit that sandwich before the commercial and spat it out as soon as they said cut. I promise you. Look at that. Look at, look at how good that looked. Nah. Come on, man. If I busted that out, the wrapper, the bacon be sliding off. As soon as you bite it, the egg is sliding up. The egg going that way once I bite it. Nah, it, it never looks that good. Extra bacon, egg, and cheese biscuit at Carl's Jr. and Hardee's. See X Men Days of Future Past and. I, I, I think I remember that. I think I remember this one. Is this one of them, the way they throw, it's like a... Damn! I don't care. I don't care how attractive you are. You just threw a cannonball through my window. What are you gonna do about that? I just spit everywhere, all over my desk, all over. Hey, yo, what? Face it, fellas. Axe never really smelled that good. Bro, we used to shower ourselves with Axe body spray. I had an old collection. My girlfriend made me throw it away. Now, what I had, I had the Apollo, the, the, the what was it called? The Dark Temptation, Brown Temptation, or something like that. We thought we was cool. To... <laughs> Boy, we thought we was fresh. I was working the other day and I was getting stuff off the shelves and that conversation just came up. And the lady that was shopping there said, yeah, I'm a teacher and boys be wearing that and they think they smell good, but me and other girls just be covering our nose and saying, ew, like, come, like, we, okay, we get it. You, you, you ain't had to drop the bomb on us like that. 
accent wasn't really all like that, man. Now boys going over to, to Chanel, uh, the Versace, all that good cologne stuff. It's pretty expensive, too. You gotta watch your pockets. Three cost of lights, please. Come on! Everybody to the back of the mind of Bill. See, I'm for real. We're delivering these MOP tactics. Cold. Here we go. Scott Danshaw was never afraid of a good dare. Or even a I remember that. Dare. A dare made him a legend at Brunner Valley High. And a pro basketball player for 10 seconds. Scott Danshaw, we have three more dares for you. Mild Chipotle, Hot Habanero, and Fiery Ghost Boy, Pepper. Taco Bell. Y'all can't tell me Taco Bell used to hit up them nasty burritos. And don't y'all hate when they have these amazing food, awesome food. These fast food restaurants be dropping bangers on the menu. But it only be out for a limited time. Why? Why is it out for a limited time? I need, I need to know. Like nacho fries. Taco Bell need to keep nacho fries on the menu 24-7. Why do y'all make it disappear for months and then bring it back for weeks? I don't get it, dude. Why not just keep it on the menu? Snack wraps at McDonald's. Bring those back permanently. It's crushing to ear that they don't sell them once you get to the drive-thru. You had your mouth set on them. Come on, man. Bring these foods back and keep them. Just keep them. I don't, uh, maybe there's some business side to it that I don't understand, but if it's bringing customers, keep it on the menu. Bell's new $1 Daredevil loaded growers. Try all three if you dare. And there was a dollar. Come on, man. Hi, I'm Sasha. Nice to meet you. Hi, I'm Danny. Nice to meet you. So I love sleeping in, I love watching sport, and I love Top Gear. I could watch Ultimate Fighting all day. Listen, I just want to be up front. Between March and October, I belong to the footy. It's actually illegal to streak at major sporting events. Ridiculous. I love fishing. Look, I've got PlayStation thumb. What goes on tour? I can't, I can't show you my tattoo. tattoo. Well, well, not, not here. here. What? The Dilemma. Jim Beam. The Bird. What? What? What does this? Is this beer or just cola? I missed something. What does that have to do with this beverage? I've asked that question multiple times in this one video. What do these commercials have to do with the product they're selling? They weren't banned. They were canceled. Okay, here we are in Utah, and this is Sam and his Nissan Frontier. He's about to crush Devil's Ridge. <gasps> Okay, watch the rocks. Okay, it's fine. <laughs> oh, oh. Are you getting this? What? Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> wow! You see how they be putting the messages at the bottom? <laughs> they, cause they know people stupid. They be putting messages at the bottom. Watch the rocks. Okay, it's fine. Come on. Are you getting this? It said trucks can't snowboard. Do not attempt. Wow. Or do barrel rolls. Do not attempt. <laughs> the mid-sized Nissan Frontier with full-size capability. Innovation for doers. Innovation. Okay, that one made sense. Maybe it was banned because the first part with it snowboarding was kind of stupid, but it makes sense. It's telling you that the truck can survive. And in the snowy terrain, it's capable of driving through this mayhem. That makes sense. Now we know, you know what I'm saying? Oh, Spice. What? This just didn't make sense. 
What, does the smell make you more attractive? Make you turn into a bear? Speaking of Old Spice, have, fellas, fellas, I'm speaking to the fellas. Have y'all ever had the gel deodorant? Dude, if you had a cut, a scratch, a, a bump, anything on your armpit, if you put that mug on, you, you, you smooth that mug across that cut, it will burn the whole day. That happened and I put Old Spice down. I don't even use none of their products. Trash. Okay, better. That was cool. I don't. I don't see why that would get banned, though. I don't see why that would get banned. That was a pretty cool. You know, it had a Statue of Liberty, and it showed the Statue of Liberty on the bottles. I, I feel like that was cool. The music was motivating. The music make you want to get up. I don't know the problem about this one. Imitation cheese is made mostly with oil and water. Fake cheese is made out of water. It's not made out of cheese. It's not made out of, like, the cheese. And, or milk, right? It's not made out of milk. Every three-quarter ounce craft single is made from five ounces of milk. Sometimes boys make mistakes, but I know this boy won't. Oz! Love. 90% of crash singers fat real cheese plus things like the pre and pussy culture and soda the rest of the grams are emulsifiers and preservatives they help them melt nicely and give it long shelf life that help it nice all right now all right craft Ew! I was looking at the sofa. No, you won't. <gasps> oh, it's exactly what we've been looking for. I can see why this one was banned. Stupidity. And sex. Damn, I can barely see this. Who is that? This morning, 9, oh, it's Mike. In my career. I've lost almost 300 games. 26 times I've been trusted to take the game winning shot and missed. I've failed over and over and over again in my life. That's real. All right, that was some banned commercials. I recognize some of them, but not all of them. The one with the Doritos, the dog taking off his own collar. Like the paws are just like this. That had me. I don't know why that was so funny to me. If y'all want me to react to some more banned commercials or anything just goofy for that matter, let me know in the comments down below. I had fun making this video. So please hit that like, comment down below and timestamp your favorite part of the video. And don't forget to subscribe on your way out. Out, y'all. Yeah.